Hi everybody, I wanted to talk to you today about dysfunctional energies in relationships. Um, they can happen all the time and I think the most important thing that can happen when we have energies that are not working for us in relationships is the establishment and the recognition that we probably have some energetic ties or hooks or cords between you and whatever that relationship is. So that could be a person, a job, a situation, but there's going to be some kind of disconnection there or energy that isn't really working properly. So that can feel a little bit like codependence. It can feel a little bit like um, some toxicity or reactivity or ego. But whenever we're kind of caught up in our thoughts around something, we probably need to do a little bit of a disconnection process or a detachment process so that we can feel a little bit released from it, actually. And there's lots of ways that we can do it, but typically kind of bringing in a little bit of a, a detachment or releasing kind of mantra around I choose to release everything that isn't mine and bring everything back to me that is mine. So I'm 100% myself, no more and no less. Something like that is actually a really powerful process to go through so that we can feel a little bit more ourselves and feel better. I hope that helps. But tune in, see if there's anything or anyone that you feel a little bit kind of enmeshed in or dysfunctional with and try it and see how you go.